Hi, I'm Hayley and welcome to another of our Christmas craft videos. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make your own pine cone Christmas tree decoration, just like this one or like this one. Now, if you've been a part of our Christmas Hope Bag project, then you will receive almost everything you need to make these in your bag. And if not, don't worry because I'm going to tell you what resources you need so you can make them yourselves at home. So what are you going to need to make these pine cone Christmas trees? Well, you're going to need a pine cone and it could be a big one or it could be a small one. And you're going to need some kind of ribbon to tie around it so that you can hang it up. Then you're going to need the things to decorate it with. So you might like to use some felt pom-poms, which you're going to push inside it. Or you might like to use one of these sparkly pipe cleaners, which you can use as tinsel. And if you'd like to add some glitter, you're going to need some glue and glitter too. Let me show you how to make them. In order for you to make the pom-pom pine cone, you're just going to need to take your little pom-poms and you're just going to need to press them in like I'm doing here all the way around the pine cone. If you find they're not going to stay in, you could use some glue to hold them in place, but actually they should just fit in really nicely. And just keep going until you've used all of the pom-poms up and you've got a nice even spread. And there you have it. That is how you make the first pom-pom pine cone Christmas tree. The second one is to add some glittery tinsel. So all you're going to do is take this pipe cleaner, this nice sparkly pipe cleaner, and you're just gonna weave it round between all the little pieces of the pine cone, kind of be creative, go up and down in between all of the spokes and just make it look pretty as you wind it right the way around. Keep going until you have used up all of the tinsel and then just kind of fasten it off by kind of sticking it in to um, the inside of the pine cone, kind of pushing it in so it's not going to come out. And there you've got it. That is your pine cone tinseled Christmas tree. All finished. There we go. And the final version I'm going to show you is if you do want to add some glitter to your pine cone and you want to make the edges all sparkly, you're going to need some glue for this. So you need some runny glue. So PVA is perfect because it's runny and it also dries clear. So all you're going to do here is just kind of put glue on the ends of each of the bits on the pine cone. So just kind of put glue all the way around the ends of each frond. Is that what they're called? Um, each little part of the pine cone. You just want to cover it in as much glue as you can. Um, and then you're just going to open your glitter and you're going to sprinkle it over. You don't need lots. It's enough just to kind of pinch the glitter and kind of sprinkle it over the top. And my suggestion would be is to do that once and then go back and do it again to kind of catch any of the pieces that you've missed. But you just want to sprinkle your, your glitter evenly over the glue and then shake it out so the excess glitter comes out and you can go back and do that again. And I'm just going to carry on now and do the other half of the pine cone. There you can see me doing the other half of the pine cone now and sprinkling more glitter on top of the glue. Don't worry if there is glue left because it will dry clear if you're using PVA. And there you go, there is my finished pine cone and it will look all sparkly and lovely hung up on my Christmas tree. So there you have it. That is how you make your very own pine cone Christmas tree. And you can hang it up in your house as a decoration or you could hang it on your very own Christmas tree. You can do with it whatever you like. We would love to see photos of your finished makes. So why not send them to us on our Facebook page at Crosby Methodist Circuit. We hope you've had lots of fun crafting along with us today. And we hope you have a very, very Merry Christmas. Bye for now.